the goal, just so you know, is to raise for every person that is selected, uh, $1,500. There we go, everybody. Okay, seven miles in the books, a steezy kind of day. I think about 750 a mile approximately. <coughs> Excuse me, there it is on your screen in the Ultra Pro Vision 4s. I think, sadly, these are my first Ultra shoes of 2020, a zero drop shoe. I like Ultras for stretching out the calves, stretching out the soleus, and they felt great, great today. I gotta say, really, really good, the Ultra Pro Vision four so there you go and all right time to foam roll and stretch and it's just gonna have to wait everyone the foam rolling and stretching has to wait i'm too excited about talking with all of you on all these updates oh my goodness it's happening and thank you for your patience a lot of people have been asking how to register for the virtual races how to get t-shirts and how to support those who have been affected by COVID-19 in a big, big way. So here's the updates, here we go. We're diving in and I'm looking over here because I got a lot of notes and I don't wanna mess up any of the dates. So first of all, let's talk about the Demore Global Running Virtual Races. I can't believe it's gonna happen. Um, all right, here we go. So April, Sunday, April 19th, 2020, it's go day. So 5K, 10K, half marathon and marathon. And yes, shout out to Wolf, Creek Race Management out in the PA. They are helping me. They they set this entire thing up on runsignup.com, okay? So if there's any day to go down to the description of a vlog, today's the day. The link to the sign up is down there through runsignup.com and you can register, zero dollars, okay? It's free, 5K, 10K, half marathon and marathon. And as far as the t-shirts go though, here's another date to mark down. They will cost money and they will, we're gonna do it through Teespring here on YouTube on April 10th. So the t-shirts will be available through Teespring on April 10th. So mark that date down if you want a t-shirt for the virtual races, the design is almost done, I love it. Um, they will be available April 10th. Now, as far as submitting your results from your 5K, 10K, half marathon, marathon, you will send your results to Demore virtual results at gmail.com and this is all explained in the link down below and it's official like these results from around the world that you will have to show proof okay through strava or through garmin or nike um and then you will submit it to that email and then a couple days later all of the results will be aggregated together put together and we'll see how everyone does around the world it's just going to be so fun and of course, we're all gonna be running different courses and I'm, I'm registering for the marathon. It's gonna be insane. So that is the deal with the Demore Global Running first ever virtual races. I can't believe it's happening. And one last point on the races, like if you're in high school or you're part of a running club, like invite everyone to join the virtual races. Like anybody can join literally around the world and it's zero dollars, okay? So I think if you're in high school and like your track season was canceled, this could be a fun kind of, don't go run together now, don't go run together, but to a little rally cry to uh, for your, your teammates, you know, the milers and two milers out there to go run a 5K, I think it would be fun. Uh, so anyway, or maybe you were training for the London Marathon and the London Marathon, you know, is delayed until uh, early October, I believe it is. Uh, so maybe this is an opportunity to invite your friends in the UK or around Europe that we're going to run London. Who knows? Or Boston. Oh my gosh. The list goes on and on and on. Okay, moving on here. The light keeps going out on me, so I got to keep this concise. Here we go. Moving on from the races to the COVID-19 relief. If you didn't see the vlog from last week, upper right-hand corner, you can go watch it. I go into a lot of detail about what we're going to do to help people in need, all right, because of COVID-19 and what's happening out there in the economy, all right? Again, upper right-hand corner, so you can go into more detail. So here we here's the deal. April 8th, 2020, I'm going to run around the track. Wednesday, April 8th, 2020, mark it on your calendar. That is the day I'm going to go live on YouTube and I'm going to go run and I'm going to go run. And every lap that I run, people are going to pledge uh, a certain amount of money uh, for each lap that I do. Okay. And I'll just tell you right now, uh, the longest run of my life was 50 miles 
and I guarantee I'm gonna run at least 20. I'm just putting it out there right now, okay? So there's another link down in the description right now where you can go make a pledge, and this is gonna be a gift, okay? Individual to individual, just wanna make that clear. Uh, I talked to an accountant, and as long as it's, it's a gift, okay? This is not a donation, this is not a fundraiser, this is a gift where you're gonna gift me money, and then I'm gonna gift the money to those people in need, okay? Just wanna make that clear, and I'm just gonna pull up just to confirm, here we go. The gifting, all right, is going to be on PayPal, Venmo, and Google Pay. Not on Super Chat here on YouTube, okay? It's going to be on uh, PayPal, Venmo, and Google. You guys, you know, many people have used all of those uh, three platforms, especially Venmo. That's how it's going to work. And if you do make a pledge, here we, here's the deal. I'm going to ask for your email address, your name, the country that you're from, and then the amount that you would like to pledge. Maybe it's five cents a lap, maybe it's five dollars a lap, okay? All right, and then after I'm done running around the track, you'll get an email back with the amount of laps that I, uh, that I ran and then multiplied by your gifting, your pledge, okay? Does that sound good? So that's how this is gonna go down and live on the day, um, there's going to be some other, well, there's, yeah, you're going to be also do, be able to do one-time gifting on the day as well, okay? So if you don't want to make a pledge today, that's okay. You can do it during the live stream when I'm running around the track. I'm trying to make sure I'm not missing any details on that. Wednesday, April 8th, 2020. Um, and yes, I am still calling and interviewing everyone that needs help. Just so you know, people a lot, oh my goodness, you would be blown away by the stories that I'm getting via email from people who are basically, they don't know what they're gonna do as far as staying in their home in the next couple of months. It's, uh, it's heartbreaking, it's heartbreaking. So thank you for helping and we're gonna do this. We're gonna do this together. Uh, I'm trying to, I'm just racking my brain, making sure I'm not missing anything. I'm gonna go inside and make some signs actually for the day of. Um, and we're gonna make this happen together, all right? So thank you for everyone that reached out and a couple of accountants reached out, CPAs reached out to me as well, just confirming that as long as it's a gift, individual to individual, we're good to go, all right? All right, and break. All right, here we go, everyone. Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna get to those signs in a minute, all right? But first, I need to actually make some phone calls to the people that we're going to be helping, okay? So here we go, here to help you and uh, get, help everyone get through this just horrible situation. So, all right, have a great day, bye. The goal, just so you know, is to raise, for every person that is selected, uh, $1,500. And so the idea is that um, that's, you know, Basically, I wanted to try and select a number that would come close to covering like someone's rent for a month. Okay, so just hanging up with the last person for today. I'll make more phone calls over the weekend. Uh, left a couple voicemails, but hearing the voices of these folks who lost their job because of COVID-19 and are just very, like, I think I spoke to th two single mothers, a single dad, um, just really challenging situations right now. Um, so I invited them to film a two to three minute video. Uh, they don't have to though, only if they want to. If they want to share their story with me and therefore with you in, a, in the first live stream Monday night when we'll do more of the pledging for the laps around the track. And basically they'll send me a two to three minute video through their phone and then I will show it to you in that live stream just so you can see the faces and the voices of the people that you will be able to help and impact their lives in a very tangible way. Because I just heard their voice through the phone and it's uh, like, you know, one of the moms was crying over the phone just because it's, um, it just, it actually, the day the video published last week was the day she was fired. So, okay, let's go make these signs. Okay, my love. Okay. We're gonna beat the virus. Oh, yes. We're gonna beat the virus together. Yes, YouTube. If, they, if there's any artists out there that know how to make beautiful signs, let me know. I need some signs for the live stream oh. Wednesday, April 8th. We're, okay. we're going around laps. Yes, yes, it's go time. It's go time, hon. I might need my little uh, chicken sandwich. Oh, yes. I don't know how long I'm gonna run. I have free coupons at Chick-fil-A. Oh, perfect, perfect. Okay. 
Uh, so we're going to yeah. beat the virus together. You would be amazed at the stories that I heard today on the phone. Thanks for sharing. If you're out here out there watching. Um, Lives are devastated. Yeah, very, very devastated. So, but wow. together we're stronger. And yeah. question of the day, real quick, is not connected to running, but to your life. How has the virus impacted mm. your life? Mm. I'd say one of the biggest ones for us is probably homeschooling. Homeschooling. Ah. It's a whole new God world. Love teachers. It's a whole new world. So, anyway. Yeah. But oh, beat the beat virus, that baby. virus. All right. Boom. Oh, oh yeah. Oh. 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 <laughs> Elbows. Elbows. <laughs> Why I did we not right get? Because you went and got it at Costco. Out of it. Yeah. Yeah. They, yeah. It's perfect. They so. My high was. Oh, my high was making the beat the virus sign. There we go, boys. This is for Papa's gonna run a long ways to help raise some money for people that lost their job because of the coronavirus. So I made a sign and we're gonna need to make a lot more signs. Maybe you guys can make some signs. And then we're gonna, Papa's gonna go run around the track. Yes. Like this. These people were forced to stop working. Mm -hmm. In America, we work hard. We mm -hmm. like to work hard. Mm -hmm. Sometimes the government, well, this is the one time the government says, mm -hmm. stop working. Hey, we're signing off from the DeBoer Global Running Dinner. There we go. Tossing it back on the right to, right there, last week's uh, announcement of this great endeavor. All right. The boys are excited. The boys are excited. <laughs> Seek beauty, work hard, and love each other. See you tomorrow. <laughs> Ciao.